Sagittarius, welcome to my channel and welcome to your bonus reading. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we're going to get you some important love messages that you need to hear today. And for those of you who would like to book a personal reading with me, information is in the description box below. Um, I've added some new options. So check it out if you want to. Today is the 14th of January. Time is 10.53 a.m. here in Bali, Indonesia. Okay, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me. Important love messages that Sagittarius need to hear today. Last words at the bottom of the deck. Hmm. A lot of pentacles here. That means I feel like your love situation either could be related to work, money, or your person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, or a Taurus. Hmm. Unless you have a lot of earth somewhere in your chart. Three of pentacles, five pentacles, seven of pentacles, and reverse. I see for some of you, Saj, if you are representing the Nine of Pentacles and the Empress here, but it could go vice versa. If this is you, these two, these two are you, I feel like maybe this person is thinking about working things with you. This is someone maybe you're angry with currently and may, you may not want to speak with currently with the Two of Swords. Or they may be upset with you. Eight of Cups of Verse. Should I stay or should I leave? Is there a future in this connection with the Ten of Pentacles in Verse? So this person may want to come in, but very slowly with the Nine of Pentacles. And maybe offer a solution. Feels like a solution. Three of Pentacles is like working together. Compromise. And try and see if we can fix this. Five of Pentacles you know um someone may be feeling like they're being left out in the cold someone may be thinking that they're investing way too much when i say someone that means it could be you or the other person investing way too much and it's not worth it i you know i'm better off being single nine of pentacles again it could be you thinking this way or this other person but i feel like such someone wants to talk about the future but someone is growing complacent of being where they're at right now okay i don't know again whether it's you or this person it, it feels very complacent right if you look at the empress just sitting there i'm good two swords i don't want to talk about it i'm good where i'm at right now nine of pentacles i'd rather be alone be single doing my own thing than being stuck eight of cups in reverse in this situation with this person where it takes so much work i don't know whether it's you or this person but with the knight of pentacles i feel like it's a it could be your person and then your person may feel like let's take it slow let's try and fix things but then again it could be your energy saying you know no <laughs> I'm good. I'm good where I'm at right now because, you know, again, if you look at the Empress is sitting there pretty, you know, oh, I'm comfortable where I'm at right now, which is without you in my life. I'm, I'm happy, Nine of Pentacles, being independent, doing my own thing. Like, I don't need you, that kind of an energy. Hmm. Because of that, such for some of you, this person could be upset because of, you know, how you or why you don't want to speak with them, or why you don't want to compromise with them. Hmm. Unless, again, roles are being reversed here. 
Or it could be this person growing way too complacent. And you try to talk to them, you try to want to fix things and they <laughs> and they're not doing anything about it. Look, head to head, um, Queen of Swords, Nine of Swords. You know, I feel like there is an age difference. If not, maturity level is definitely different between you and this person. One of you is definitely way more mature than the other. So these two are fighting um, arguments for sure. Your person could be a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. Strength in reverse. Losing that patience and with the Six of Pentacles. Kind of makes me feel like someone is done. Someone is losing their patience or has already lost their patience. Either this has already happened or that it's happening soon. Because the Nine of Swords is a very fast energy. So something about an argument face-to-face -face argument just can't disagree i feel like both of you could be butting heads five of cups very disappointed and then with the page of swords here could also indicate some sort of confrontation in regards of someone either being very sneaky or very selfish someone could be feeding another person page of swords can be an indication of someone finding out that this person has been lying or cheating but it feels like this energy with the knight of swords that maybe this person is gaslighting you or again it could go vice versa someone is gaslighting someone because it feels like he or she doesn't want to admit you know how you get angry and you've got some proof you've seen something and then you confront that person the person calls you crazy that you know it's all in your head and then they scream at you instead so this is the energy that i'm getting here so i feel like such for some of you maybe this has already happened and you're just so done with it and some of you i feel like space could be encouraging you to be done with it and cut this person off um because you don't want to get stuck in this predicament because maybe the future you know the future ten of pentacles in reverse just when it's in reverse it could either mean that maybe there is no future or a delayed future with this person or that maybe it wouldn't come to fruition or that this person cannot give you what you want because no matter what the knight of pentacles is still younger much younger than the empress so this person needs time to grow up or to be able to commit or want to commit but in the meantime i see for a lot of you Sag, you could just be doing this already right now just being independent doing your own thing and couldn't be bothered to talk to this person but for those of you Sag, if you're still going through the situation with this person who's gaslighting you I feel like Spice definitely telling you to just block this person, cut this person off. Don't talk to this person for a while and do your own thing and let them come to you when they're ready. If you still want them, if they do come to you when they're ready, you don't want them anymore, then too bad, you know. Pull out a few of these cards here. soulmate forgiving and learning yeah this person may ask for a forgiveness past life relationship some of you may be meeting someone new coming in whom could be a soulmate with past life uh, relationship that you had with this person but um, for some of you it could be the same person you know soulmates people always think that soulmates you're supposed to be with with your soulmate forever but that's not the case uh, most times soulmates are here to teach us a lesson to, for us to teach each other lessons and we've got pay attention to the red flag see then we've got separation so some of you are definitely saying if this person is gaslighting you and you've already gotten concrete evidence or if you really know who this person truly is and they've been making you cry disappointing you then it's time to cut this person off focus on yourself but I think this person is going to come in and try and ask for forgiveness but very slow energy yeah 
All right, Sash, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a couple of playlists on the screen right now. First one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But these readings are still new, so they're still relevant because I post them every single day. And I'll upload them right away, so check them out if you want to. And just a reminder that um, I have added new options for to book a personal reading with me. Again, information is in the description box below. Hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Take care, Satch. Bye.